Rachel James and Danielle Riolo honored before St. John Fisher Field Hockey played their final home game of 2011 against Utica. 30 minutes in, Utica's Louise Steele Norton nets one to give the Pioneers a 1-0 lead. In the second half, the Utica attack kept pressuring, but Kelly Redmond kept the Pioneers at bay. But Louise Steele Norton was on her game tonight as she nets her second goal of the contest to give Utica the 2-0 win. The Cardinals close out their inaugural season with an overall record of 2-15. Despite the loss, head coach Tara Christensen has some high hopes for next season. Great way to end the season. You know, the girls, Utica's top of the conference, I mean, stat-wise, I mean, execution-wise. So the girls, the first half was our best 35 minutes of field hockey. They played together, they talked, we had some quality shots. Um, just great performance overall. You know, like I've said before, our whole motto has been better than before. Um, they've progressed. I mean, huge improvements. We've been together nine weeks, brand new team, um, very heavy with freshmen. So they've just, they've been making the changes. They've been getting it done. Looking ahead to the off season, um, just going to work on the basics, their stick skills, their receptions, playing together, you know, the two, three groups of players moving the ball at field um, and just, you know, getting them in the gym, working the weight room and the conditioning program. You know, our seniors were, they were part of the group that started the club team here at Fisher four years ago when they were freshmen. So they've kind of, you know, seen the club program grow into this varsity program and they've been a part of, you know, everything. They were very integral in the progression of the team. Just, you know, great leaders. They were a huge asset on the field and off, especially to this big, you know, class of freshmen. Um, so we'll definitely, you know, remember them and just, um, you know, honor them like the girls did tonight.